Hey guys, welcome to the video. Siberian Husky, a wolf-like dog stands up high on the list of most handsome, sturdy, and tough dogs around the world. They resemble a wild counterpart, but are not derived from wolves. If you are looking for a Siberian Husky, then watch this video first, because there are 10 things you didn't know about Siberian Husky. Let's begin the countdown. On number 10, oldest dog in history. The Siberian Husky breed was bred by the Chukchi tribe in northern Siberia, people who inhabited the cold Siberian peninsula and lived close to the Eskimo people. The Husky was very much part of their culture for centuries, and they were perfect for this environment. The weather conditions went down to negative 50 degrees Celsius, which is the chilliest. But it didn't affect much, because the Siberian Husky breed was genetically designed to live in hard temperatures. A recent study that analyzed the genetics of more than 161 domesticated dogs found that the Siberian Husky is the fourth oldest dog in the world. The Husky was used to pull sleds and was critical for the survival of the Chukchi. They were taken as pets to protect from intruders and dangerous animals. These dogs gained strength and became powerful at time. The Siberian Husky is unlikely to have derived from wolves. According to a 2014 study, it is likely they both came from a common ancestor, somewhere between 9,000 and 34,000 years ago. Next up at number 9 is Colored Eyes and Size and Coat Siberian Husky is born with blue eyes, which change to gray before settling on brown. The most striking look, though, is when each eye is a different color, one brown and one blue. This is called heterochromia. Siberian Huskies can often be found with two different colored eyes. This is a hereditary trait that gives them an incredible look, especially as one of those eyes is usually an incredible blue color. They appear much smaller in size than the wolves. Usually, the male is taller and heavier than the female, the female height being around 55 to 56 centimeters, with a weight of around 19 to 20 kilograms, whereas the male has a height of between 54 to 60 centimeters and an average weight of about 23 to 24 kilograms. The two coats consist of a dense undercoat that falls out typically twice a year, once before the winter months so it can grow back thicker, and once before the summer months so it can grow back thinner. The outer coat consists of guard hairs, and as well as providing an extra layer of insulation, also protects the husky from insects. This primary coat also helps to keep the rain and snow from getting to its skin. Next up at number 8 is Siberian Husky can adapt to any environment. The Siberian Husky is a dog that can adapt to cold and icy climates. Its thick fur is a testimony to their endurance in the country of their namesake. The Siberian Husky is also able to adapt to more temperate climates. Next up at number 7 is a terrible guard dog with a high prey drive. Siberian Husky may look aggressive, but he is the opposite. They can get scared very easily. Siberian Husky cannot judge the intruder and may take them as a friend. He doesn't get alert easily, which makes him a bad guard dog. He can be a great pet because he is very calm and friendly, but making him a guard dog can make things worse. The Siberian Husky is a very sociable breed of dog and will happily spend its life with its human owner and family. It is not aggressive and doesn't get jealous easily, but always consider him as the only pet at home because he won't let any other animal stay in your house for long. Siberian Husky sees every small mammal has prey. As soon as their eyes detect any small animal near your house, before you will know they will attack him. Never let them off the leash and always keep an eye on them. This dog hates the cat and sees it as prey. You may encounter unfortunate consequences if a cat and a husky are living together. Next up at number 6, Most Stubborn Breeds of Dog Siberian Husky is known to be the most stubborn breed dog. Never underestimate him and fall for his calm and friendly attitude. Proper training is extremely necessary for Siberian Husky. It will help you a little bit, but you never know when something surprising will happen around you. He will never listen to you, no matter how much you scold him or train him. Siberian Husky hates to spend time indoors. No matter how bad the weather is, they want you to take them for a walk or exercise. If they're not going out because of some reason, they will howl all day and make as much noise as they could until you change your mind. You will need more practice than Husky because this dog will make you run after him. 
unwantedly you will scold him or sometimes punish him by not giving any sweet treats. But things won't change a bit for him until he is willing to change his plans. I hope you enjoyed the video. Take a pause and like and subscribe to my channel to see more amazing content coming on your way. Next up at number 5 is Siberian Husky Can Escape From Anywhere The Husky has a natural urge to escape from any kind of quarantine. If he doesn't like his crate or his homeowner, he will simply run away. Siberian Husky are keen observers. They notice everything around their space, and once they are done with all the measurements, they will escape. Siberian Husky can jump over 6-foot fences and climb over fences that are over 9 feet tall. It's like a mission to the Husky. They simply must try at all costs to escape. And usually they succeed. You won't even know when and why he ran away. The next step is much harder than you think. You won't be able to find them, though they will be very close to your place. They will come back when you are not around, roam a bit, and then leave. It's better to attach a dog locator to their collar. Next up at number 4 is Siberian Husky Exercises and Sheds a Lot. The Siberian Husky was bred to work all day pulling sleds, and this desire has stayed with it since then. Before you bring Siberian Husky into your house, you will need to know that they shed a lot. You will see fur on your carpet, couches, and clothes too. You have to regularly clean your house and brush Husky, because if you won't, you will find hairs in your food, in your bed, and very soon reaching your mouth. The Siberian Husky should be exercised at least twice a day, for about an hour each time at least. If you can't exercise them outside, you will need to do the exercise inside. You need to be more active because your dog is extremely energetic and strong and is expecting the same from you. On number 3 we have, Siberian Husky will never miss you. Well, if you haven't seen a mean dog around, let me introduce you to this one. Siberian Husky will need you as long as you are providing him with all his needs. As soon as he will find out that you are no more fun, he will ignore you like you never existed. If you're going on a long trip, don't worry because your dog won't care if you're not around. You will realize when you'll come back from your trip, your dog will behave like you're someone new entering his territory. Even though the Siberian Husky loves the attention it gets from us humans, it is a truly independent dog and he doesn't need us. He will silently escape and prey on small mammals for the rest of his life and live in peace. It seems like Husky has no idea what a threat or loneliness means. Next up at number 2 we have Vocalization and Howling Siberian Husky loves to talk with an incredible range of sounds. Their howling can be heard up to 15 kilometers away. They make a noise that is usually a howl and they usually make these sounds when they are sad or bored. So basically, it's their way of communicating with you that something is upsetting them in some way. Before we move on to number 1, please smash that like button and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Last in the line on number 1 we have, Siberian Husky Loves Children The Siberian Husky adores children, which is one of the reasons why it can make a great family pet. It is non-aggressive, non-possessive breed, and these are qualities that you like to see in a dog that's going to be spending time around your children. They can make a fantastic friend and companion, and to see your children and the husky grow up together is awesome. Comment down below and tell us, what dog breed is your favorite as a pet? Thank you for watching. We will see you in the next video.